And how long is it until this goes bad? Two days? Four days? Okay. I'll eat, I'll eat in the dungeon. I will eat up when I'm in the dungeon. Okay. There might be some ghouls out here. A couple of ghoul boys. So I will try not to die to them. Oh, and you... Snork, I think you asked how the dual wield berserker died, and I don't know what I said, but I'm pretty sure I actually died to ghouls. Now that I think about it, I think I died to ghouls. Uh, I, don't, I don't know what I answered you with, but whatever it was, I think that was a lie, because I'm pretty sure I died to ghouls. Didn't immobilize him, but that's okay. Oh, I wish you could skin the ghouls, too. Side note. Shout out to the ability to skin the ghouls. I wish you could. I want ghoul leather. You can skin a horse and a dog, but not a ghoul? Like, come on. That doesn't make any sense. Let me skin the ghoul. And this combo is so amazing. I think, I think it was Panty that told me the correct order to use those skills in, but it's so, so satisfying. I love using them. I'll need more energy in the future because I run out after every combat, but it's great. Fight me, little bat. I don't know why I used an ability on the bat. That was like such a waste. Oh, I used it wrong. That was that was a mistake. I, I used the abilities in the wrong order. And as such, did not get the cool combo. Rip to me. I didn't mean to pick up this axe or club, whatever it is. <coughs> no matter what it is, I didn't want it. Oh, what? I didn't realize I was in, in combat range with him. There we go. Glad I got it right that time. He was still immobilized for a while, too. The short shield, my short sword. I, I'm having so much trouble talking today. Like, I think I'm dying or something. I don't know why I can't speak. But that short sword's worth, like, just a little bit. Um, I should have let myself heal and get the energy. Too used to playing on a late-game character where you can just run through a dungeon. I need to remember I'm a noob again. I'm just a little baby. I am not capable of running through this dungeon at mock speed. I need to run through it at, like, uh, I need to crawl through it. I need to go through it crawl speed. I didn't want this sword to, to get for the quest, though, so... And I will rest. I was just talking about it and then totally forgot immediately. Then I saw my energy and I was like, what are you doing? Start resting. You're, you're playing like a madman. What even was this? Was that, is that a zombie's corpse? It looks so strange. It's just like so mutilated. It, mu it must be a zombie corpse, but it just looks so like so broken. Never felt bad for a zombie before, but I, I do now. Is this even worth taking? Yeah, whatever. I'll take it. I'm not going to get that much good gear here, so... Oh, I was like, what did he drop? But it was just another bone. He just dropped all his bones. Oh, and I got another splint. Let's go. So I have two now. That's the number I wanted to have. I am so greedy with my salves. Just use it. Your leg like, needs it. I don't know why I'm so greedy with them. I buy, like, just too much medicine, and then I never want to use it. Ooh. Oh, I did it backwards again. And then I walked forward. I'm playing so poorly. I need to focus up. I need to focus up. Rest. Rest before I go in there. Did we clear all the way out down here? No, we did not. So I'll need to go back down there, too. So I made it, like, all the way through Yana's playthrough without failing a single quest. And then I failed a quest on, like, day one of this playthrough. So that's quite different. That is quite different. That's okay, though. Peasant spear? I think it's worse than my spear. Not even really worth checking. Or do I have a peasant spear? No, a militia spear. Clearly more powerful than a peasant spear. I'm part of the militia. So 
So because I failed the first quest, I won't be able to do two quests before doing the Oaken Barrel Brewery, but I'm still going to be level three, so that'll be hopefully fine. Hopefully that's enough. And I keep using the abilities wrong. That's just my bad. That is simply my bad. I should have rest. Oh, what? Another bug. The, the I had a skeleton before that triggered a trap he wasn't on. That's uh, I think that's new to this uh, this update. Okay, got my level. I'm in pain, but I got my level. Um, so I already took leg sweep. I don't even think I got to this level last time. I think I only got level two. I'm level three now. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I'll just stick with the spears tree. This is a really good tile. What do they say? Moving to other tiles removes the effect, except when moving with maneuvers? Is that last part new? Because isn't this a maneuver? Yeah, this is a maneuver. So I can I can use this and maintain the uh, maintain the buff from this. That's really great. I thought this skill was good without that buff to it. So that's great. They might have changed the numbers on this, and it's actually not a buff. But as far as I know, it's a buff. Um, yeah, I'll get the defensive one before I get the offensive one. So that that's good stuff. I didn't know that uh that they buffed it. I'm very stoked with that. Oh, come on, just die. You're, you're a mage skeleton. You're gonna die. Just just, just give it up. Why are you even arguing with me? We know it's over. And I'm out of medicine again, but, but I'm pretty poor. So I'll eat this food, eat this food, throw these things. I'll paint. I'm, I'm in pain like a pretty decent amount. Um, just let the bat walk in and I'll stab him. Oh, come on, don't miss to a bat. The bat bled me. Come on, like, are you kidding me? And then I will kick, and walk back, and then do the standard combo. There's more more combat set in my way. So hopefully I kill this zombie before they get here. Oh, they're not even, they, they're just wiggling back and forth. That's fine. As long as they don't come down here, I don't really care what they do up there. They can live their best life walking back and forth. Spirit and not get buffed, nerfed. Over in overall skills and attribute scaling. Oh, yeah, I, I did hear that spears got nerfed. I just meant this stat specifically. I don't remember what what the numbers were on this. Um, so I meant that this might have gotten nerfed numerically, but the uh, the bottom pile, bottom tile, or ugh, bottom text is like a direct buff to this skill. If, if the numbers didn't get changed, then that skill got a small buff. And maybe even not a small buff, maybe a, a respectably sized buff. But I did hear yesterday that ah, I didn't mean to walk in. I was just misclick. Uh, yesterday that the nerfs, or the uh, spears overall got a little worse this patch. So that sucks. That sucks for me playing a spear build, but that's fine. Oh, I'm out of energy. I'll just let him. I'll just let him walk up to me. Might as well. No point walking into him. I doubt this is worth picking up. Yeah, no, there's no way. It'll sell for, like, one gold. Secret room? It's worth checking. Ah, oh, come on. <clears throat> I only remember that No Retreat had 7.5 7 block chance. Okay. So if they nerfed it by, like, 50% and gave it the, the movement, like, the plus of being able to move, then the skill got nerfed entirely. It got buffed for that one skill. No, it didn't. It also didn't get nerfed. Okay, so it was 5% before. Either way, as, as, as you couldn't move at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, oh, so it did get nerfed. It got nerfed from 7.5, but then they compensated with that with the movement. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the flat values were nerfed, but the, um, the skill was adjusted. Oh, I didn't check this room. I should have checked this room. I really need to check every room for a secret room. Or for a secret passage. If I ever want to find one, I have to be doing that. And I'm not going to do the, the kick on this one. I'll wait till he walks up. It stacks could up to four, now it's three. I thought it still said four. It only stacks up to three. Aw. So, yeah, this is... That's actually a pretty pretty substantial nerf. Um, 
to the again you can move so it's easier to maintain the buff but uh oh i should have moved that was my bad but um but yeah you can move now so you can maintain the buff a lot easier but if you weren't if you were able to get the max stacks before it was a huge increase in the total amount of stats you got that sucks that sucks but yeah again you can move now that is a big change I should have kicked this guy. This guy I should have kicked. Yeah, and I do agree that the mobility is a huge part, but, you know, the skill is adjusted. The flat values were nerfed, though. But the skill overall might be better. Which of these? I want I want all of these. I want, I want this to, for the quest, and this is better than this. Um, whoa. Whoa. I didn't realize there was an enemy here. Oh, I didn't get the immobilize. I was like, did I do it wrong? But that was just RNG. I simply didn't roll high enough to get the immobilize on that one. And I feel like when I get hit, little green particles are popping off me. Like, like poisonish particles. Is that new? Or do I, have I just not noticed it before? But I, I feel like I, I like I'm, there's a new animation here. I don't know if it's an animation, a new effect. Okay, just don't, don't give me a ghost. Dang it! Come on. Can you kick a ghost? Not really. Whatever. I'll kick the ghost. Okay, that was totally that was super easy. I was a little worried about that. As, as mentioned like a million times, I fear the ghosts. I fear them desperately. Maybe too much. Oh, let's go medicine. The loot here has been decent, especially if this is good. If the modifiers are on, on are good on there, or if it's cursed and it's a good curse, then, then I'll be really happy with the loot so far. Even if the mods aren't that good, though, it's still fine. Hmm... Okay. What did I... How did... Maybe they swapped. I was like, how did I kill the bat in the back? But maybe they swapped position and I didn't notice. And eh, board shield I'm not going to take. That's, that's, that's a trash item. I will not take it. Even if the enchantments are good. I, I'm not using a shield and it's like the worst shield in the game. I'm going to wait one turn so I can hit the bat with the ability. Come on, zombie. Just go down. You're already dead. Just, just, just accept it. You were dead before we even started fighting because you were a zombie. Okay. I was like, why can't I walk through? Because there was a dude there. That would make a lot of sense for why I couldn't walk through. I didn't mean to walk forward. I suck so bad. There's like a little delay after your turn where if you hit your ability and then click, it doesn't register the ability. Um, and I think that's like intentional, like, um, and I just clicked too fast. And I, I shouldn't have opened this door. That, that's, that was a mistake. I need energy. And I might just have one of them chase me up here. If they both chase me, that'll be a little bad. Yeah, that's a little bad. This is okay, though. I will hide behind this door and medicine. Medicine up. And then I'll heal. I'll just sit here and heal. Hopefully the archer hits his buddy instead of me. But there was the, the green right there. There was green again. I don't know why that's there. Like, I feel like that wasn't there before. Like, it... The... The little green animation. I feel like it's new. Look at that green splat. I, I, I almost certainly would have noticed that before, too. Um, it's just kind of noticeable. Does anyone know if that little green splat's normally there? Is it because I'm wearing, like, green armor or something? It's, it's just weird. And I will medicine up a little bit more. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna come push through the dungeon some more. I don't wanna I don't wanna leave. No idea if it's new or not. Okay. Yeah. I think I would have noticed it. It's it's new when you take poison damage. Why are they poisoning me though? 
Like, it happened with a skeleton just now. Did the skeletons poison you? Because I know previously there was, like, a green splat when you were taking poison. It would, like, be, like, kind of like a green haze or whatever. But I don't think the skeletons poison you. Maybe it's just a bug and it's not supposed to be happening and it is happening. I don't know. Just a whole chain of animals. They were just they were just pogging out over there together. Rusted weapons have poison damage. Okay, I didn't know that. That's cool. Does that make them ever worth using? Like if you're early game, is there like ever a scenario where you'd like to have a He broke my arm? What do you mean he broke my arm? He's a rat. But is there ever a scenario where you would use a poisoned or a rusted weapon for the poison damage? Or is it still just they're just trash because they're so rusty? Oh, rusted swords have five durability. Okay, so they're just trashed. Yeah, okay, thank you, thank you. I didn't know that. Also, welcome in, A9 Wag. Welcome on in. First time chatter. Hope you're doing well today. I shouldn't have skipped that turn. I didn't realize I had an ability. And the damage is lower. Okay, so there's just literally no choice or no reason to use it. I didn't think there was. I just didn't know they dealt poison damage, so I thought maybe there was some secret tech I didn't know about. Playing some stone shard as well. Awesome, awesome. Um, well, if you have any suggestions for me or anything, I always like to say this to, to new viewers. I don't know how if you're if you've been lurking for a long time, but um. There is no back seating in this channel because you are welcomed in the front seat. Any of your suggestions, any questions are totally welcomed. A small portion of health is restored every infinity turns. Yeah, that isn't good. That is not good. I would I would get that up huge. I would heal more than once every infinity turns. Also, that dagger's in really good condition. Let's go. So hopefully I can finish this dungeon. I don't know if I'm gonna, I don't know. We'll see, we'll see what it looks like when I get to the boss. If I get to the boss um, and I'm still full HP and stuff, then I might I might try to finish the dungeon, but I'm out of meds. I don't have anything to help her in the food. I'm in pain and have a hangover. Oh no, rip, rip huge. Awesome, awesome. I love Stone Shard as well, so I'm really glad to see you here. I didn't mean to, I just, I'm bad. I didn't, I didn't even mean to skip the turn. I just hit the button on accident. Yeah, I love Stone Shard as well. It's a, it's a truly wonderful game. And I've been very happy with this update. I had such a blast. I played, I played eight hours each day when, for the first two days of the update. And it's such a blast both days. Been back for about an hour today. Um, and speaking of. We've been playing Stone Shard for about an hour, so this is when I try to remind everyone, if you're enjoying the content, please follow my Twitch channel. We're ever so close to reaching 50 followers, the pivotal 50. So it would mean so much if you would follow my Twitch channel. There we go, Nightbot. Thanks for the shout out. I was looking away, didn't realize this was the boss room. Maybe, maybe, maybe messed that one up a little bit. That might have been a little bit of a mistake. -y. I think I might just run. Did the boss break for a couple turns? I don't know what that was about. The boss is going to resummon a bunch of people probably, but I just don't want to die, so. And then we'll see who follows me up. It might just be the two little zombies and not the boss. Yeah, it's the two little zombies. Oh, you made it out with two, with two HP huge. Jeez, well, congratulations on living. That seems rough. What build are you going for, Huge? What are, what are you trying with your new character here? Twenty-four turns turns for a small portion while resting. I, it's better than nothing, I suppose. Not better by much, but it's better. Maces, shields, and armor. Oh, nice! You might have told me that yesterday. Oh, yeah, now, now that I read it, you might have informed me of that. No, because your character died after stream yesterday, I think, so you couldn't have informed me of that. It must have been someone else that was going maces and shields. I say this every time we talk about it, though. Oh, you're just doing the same one? Oh, okay. Well, I sorry for misremembering. 
But I, I say this every time we talk about maces and shields. I love them. I think they're so fun. They are, they're, mace and shield is my favorite play style. So I'm super stoked to see that you were playing it. Where's the door? I may or may not starve to death. I believe in you. You will make it. You will make it. Use your willpower. Eat some chanterelle mushrooms. Doing a right on target with a sword, magic mastery, and armor in combat. Yo, that sounds cool. That sounds cool, A9. And are you okay if I call you A9 or WAG? Do you have any preferences? If so, let me know, please. Um, but that sounds really cool. On my first character, that was a little bit um, higher level. I was putting some points into armored combat as well, and I enjoyed the points I put into them. Brace for impact and flexible defense are what I took, and I was very happy with them. I found them to be quite powerful. Okay, no preference. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Then I will call you either A9, A9 Wag, or just Wag. I'll keep I'll keep it mixed up. Spice of life. When oh, I want these chanterelles, because my 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 uh, morale is gonna go down. So I should keep an eye out for the mushrooms. I don't know what's up there. It might have just been a deer. Oh, it's a wolf. I saw it. Yeah, I just saw one little touch of it. Heard it growl as well. So I'm gonna stay away from that wolfie. That wolfie can go without me. But yeah, I've actually, I've just about never done a right on target build. Um, I have nothing against them or anything. I've just never given it a try. I can maybe, maybe for the next character. I might have already promised something for the next character though, so I don't know. I can't remember. Oh, I'm too hungry. I, can't, I won't get rid of the hunger with just these berries. I was hoping I would, but... Oh, with two. With two, I'm getting closer. Yeah. Not really, though. I'm just about gaining as much hunger as I'm getting from the berries just by walking. I left something in here, though, right? I don't have a name for this one. It's basically all about getting the Templar blade and getting a magic enchantment on it and then using Jolt Residual Charge. Oh, cool. Yeah, yeah. It's a spell blade. Yeah, that's awesome. That sounds really cool. Yeah, use your sword to deal your magical damage. That sounds great. That sounds like a cool build. Um, I love builds like that. That sounds like a neat, neat idea. I don't think I would have ever considered that either. So that's really cool. Yeah, it's fun. Definitely try it. Okay, you know what? A9, after this character, I don't know what I promised, so I'm just going to let it go to the wayside. My next build will be... will be. I'll, I'll, I'll take that as inspiration. I will... uh. <clears throat> try to do a mage build kind of but using a sword I'll channel my magic through a sword that seems cool the game lies what happened what happened huge yeah it, it might not be the best build snork but that seemed really cool I restored 4 HP while not resting okay well let's go free HP is free HP um after like 60 or 70 turns I mean, it's better than nothing. And I just bought one knight because I'm so poor. Yeah, that build might not be like the best build, but I really like it thematically. That seems like a cool build. And it's nighttime, so I will sleep till morning. <clears throat> and as mentioned, the zombie or the uh, the necromancers in like a horrible spot. They're gonna keep summoning stuff, so that's gonna suck. But I didn't want to die. Not so early into the playthrough. It looks amazing, too. Okay. Well, I like I like when things are really cool thematically. That's, that's probably more important to me than their actual power level. So I'm super stoked for that build. I have two swords here. I'll just throw this down, pick these up, and magically I know what quest you wanted. Somehow I've finished your task the moment I started it. Any RuneScape players in here? You get the uh, the special unique dialogue if you show up and accept the quest with the stuff in your inventory. The game like is like the the NPC pretends to be like shocked that you you knew what he was asking for or what they were asking for. Oh, I need Baron's ring. Give me your ring, Baron. But I always liked that about RuneScape. I liked that uh, the NPCs would, would take note that the fact that you just showed up with exactly what they asked for magically. Give me your ring. 
until next time. Whoa, whoa, not hitting anybody. I'm not going back to jail. I just ate an entire pie in one sitting. When I got out of prison, I did the same thing, huge. When they released me from the prison, I was like, I'm stealing a pie and I'm eating the whole thing. And I literally did. That bilberry? Biberry? Bilberry? I can't remember what it's called, but I ate the whole pie. You and I are, have similar ideas on how to eat a pie, it seems. All at once. Yeah, the windmill is so good. Yeah, I didn't know about that at all. That's like, I, that's great. It's like, that's arcane knowledge. The windmill is indeed amazing. Because it's stealing from the city, right? There's like that little bit of chance you could get caught or something. But stealing from the windmill, it's, like, it's free money. They're asking to be robbed. I didn't realize this is these are so cheap. Is this even new? Like, did there, was a rope belt in the game before? Um, I'm just gonna buy like some gloves. And whatever this peasant sash, it's ten gold. How could I not buy it for ten gold? And I need an identification scroll, and I'll sell this book. And if you hear the little pitter-patter, that's just my doggy leaving. He ran out of the room. He heard something that is intriguing him. I'll just buy this. Whatever. Just send it. A little bit, of more, little bit more gold, but that's okay. No identification scrolls? Oh, there's one. There's one. It was just red. I didn't expect it to be red for some reason. Not... Not cursed, but it, it's not great stats either, actually. I was going to say, but good enough stats, but the stats are just, just not that good. I'll take it. It's better than uh, better than nothing. Someone on Discord posted a way to get prudence. I want to say it's not easy to do a spell blade. I guess I dislike seeing you die more than yourself. Yeah. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't want to die, but if I would rather do a, a build that I think is unique and cool than... Um, just the same build over and over and not die because I've min-maxed it or whatever. Um, so I'm fine. If I die doing a fun build, that's that's fine with me. Um, Thief, what was the strategy to get Prudence? Because uh, I've mentioned this before, like days ago at this point, I think. But um, Prudence is my favorite buff. I like it a lot. I think it's really cool. Um, of all the mental buffs, I just personally prefer Prudence. Um, so I'd love to know how you get it. Like what, what the, the, the method to maintaining it is hmm will you try it maybe depends how how uh how convoluted it is you said it's interesting so i'm wondering what it is so yeah if you let me know i'll, I'll try it if it's too too long to type out i can i can just check the discord myself i did join the discord i'm in the stone shard discord now oh did you try to post a link to it let me see what that is what is what is that a link to you didn't even link. Why did this get deleted? I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Copy, paste. So that's it. Oh, it's the it's the the periods. The the nightbot thought that was a link. Um so don't don't click all the the links in my chat or whatever. Those aren't real. By claw trap, bandage, healing. Okay, that's way too much. Sleep till 11 p.m. Place claw trap outside your room. Remove shoes. Step on claw trap. Apply band. No, I'm not doing that. I am not doing that. Um, I appreciate you you letting me know what it is, but that uh, that is too many too many things. I'm uh, that is too complicated for me. I thought it was. I was hoping it was a little easier than that. So so I appreciate it. Uh, I know I asked for it. Yeah, I haven't tested it myself. Yeah, it's just that's a lot of. I am certain I would mess up one of those steps somewhere. And it seems like it's like a little a little buggy or something. Like not really in you know, I don't think you're supposed to be able to, to force prudence into the game, so that's fine. Hey everybody, Quist Gaming here. If you're enjoying the content, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. It truly makes a difference. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.